Okay, hey, 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 jolly good morning, everyone. Today we're going to be making a fire sick beat on FL Studio. Let me just get rid of that. And today I'm thinking I'm going to go with like some sort of like hard style f crazy shit. I want something with like some energy and like, you know what I'm saying? I want, to, I want some f f So let's just get right into it. So, channel rack, uh, we can put that down there. Okay, so what you wanna do is, you wanna make it empty, right? So you get like your stuff is empty. And then, okay, so your channel rack button's up here. Uh, so, uh, I gotta remember what I'm doing, it's been a while. Uh, so you have the channel rack. Let's go to add. And then the thing I really like, I don't have a lot of options, but the thing I really like is FL keys. It'll be in add and FL keys. And I just kinda, I just kinda, oh yeah. I just kinda leave it where it's at. So, you can, uh, yeah, we can use that. That sounds pretty good, actually. And then what I like to do is I, I feel like out of all of these, since I don't have a lot of options, like really the only good one I have is FL keys. And then what I do is, so like maybe I want to create like two different melodies. Like these are like my main like melody type things where like it's like your main part of your beat. So let's see, uh, where's my piano? Okay, so you got your piano rolled up. Ooh, ooh, and eh, that's a little too high. And then okay, I kind of remember this. You can move it up and down with control and down and stuff. That's cool. Ooh, okay. Wait, maybe I should change my BPM. Oh, uh, let's just make that like 120. I don't know. Ooh. Oh, no fucking way. Oh, my bad, guys. <laughs> I had my speakers muted. You see, you couldn't even hear my music, dude. That's so embarrassing. Here's what it sounds like. Okay, let me give that a turn up for you guys so that you can hear it a little bit better. Okay, so let's see I want to, where I want to go. Ooh, okay. We're going somewhere. Ooh, okay. That is freaking freaky. So, see, nice and simple. And then I kind of like to, yeah, you just control, ooh, control C and control V. That's a simple key bend. And then I guess we can make it four because uh, I believe that's like normal like music pace is like four steps or something like that uh, okay ooh dude I'm already killing this beat and then okay so next I'll make a second melody so you have like your second melody going on then we have to change it this one I want it to be like a little slower okay ooh okay nice rise ooh that's it that's the one you know it's the one because like you'll feel it. Oh man, that's killer. So now that we have that ready, now if I remember correctly, uh, where is it? Ooh, is this it? And then we go to the drums. Oh wait, no, 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 no. Actually. Something I like to add 
uh, where is it at? Uh, guitar stuff. I love adding guitar stuff to my FL keys. It just adds that nice fucking crazy rustic vibe to it. It is so flippin' sweet. So let's see, what does the other one sound like? That's, that's, ooh, that's so cool. Okay, so now, see. So now that we have that, we have our filters on, it's going crazy. We go to packs, and then we just like kind of just add like, like almost like one of each of these, just kind of like feel for it. You just want to like feel for it. I kind of like that one because it has a bit of an echo. Uh, let's turn that down. That's a bit loud. Turn that down as well. Okay. That's the one. Okay. And then something we can do in here. Ooh. See a nice like heavenly vibe to that one. I really, really like that one. Ooh, I kinda like that. That is so sweet. So, okay. Uh, I kind of just mess with the pitch. I find that's the best. Whoa. I actually really like that sound. It's like a little bell. Whoa. Okay. Okay. We can go for like a little bit of like a like a harder snare. Uh let's see. Maybe something like this. So it has like a nice change of pace. See, then you have the snares come in real quick. And then it goes calm. So it's like a nice mood change. What does it sound like with the other? Oh my God. That is freaking so cool. Gosh, dude, I'm actually like freaking sicko on this. So, I think really, I think really all we need here is some um, to like wrap up the beat. Is it needs a good drum, like a good like boom, and uh, kicks. That's what they are. I kind of, I'm kind of someone who likes to add two different kinds, just because it adds a little more versatility, I think. Uh, mm, mm. Maybe I gotta make it like hit a bit harder. What is that? Panning? Make it hit a bit harder. 
Okay. And then I think this is also, I think this will sound good if I add my signature guitar stuff to it. Whoa, whoa. That is heckin' cool. Because it's, it's a. Oh, okay. That is okay. So you just gotta get you gotta get like a really good feeling for your music. Hmm, something kind of sounds a little funky. Uh, maybe I gotta do like a double. That is so freaking cool because it sounds like someone getting hit in like an arcade video game. Whoa. What does it sound like when I double up? What about like that? See, you gotta be willing to experiment with your music. Do some funky stuff. I'm feeling it. Maybe like... Hmm. Ooh. Okay. What does it sound like with the other one? Yes. Okay. So now that the whole melody or whatnot is done, so now I gotta add it to the thingy. Uh, so no. Oh, that's right. Uh, think split by channel. Yes. So what do I want to start out with? Actually, you want, I like to start off with like some sounds, you know. Hmm. So I just kind of look in the side and just kind of dabble around. You know. Kind of just dabble around, look at some sounds. Ooh, that is scary. So I kind of I'm kind of liking that one uh, song, and then what? Oh, uh, so there we go. So I'm just making like a really simple beat, like like just really simple, keeping it simple for everyone at home. So I like to just start off with a simple intro. Oh. Hopefully that didn't pop up anything naughty. Uh, mm, so, uh, oh, wait a minute. Uh, uh, oh, there we go. That's what I was trying to pull it. Maybe. Mm. Ooh, I'm liking that one. Then you kind of can extend the time. Sounds like a car pulling up. Okay. So we don't need that extra bit. That doesn't do anything. Oh. Uh, so actually. Uh make the time even longer to hit that mark I need. There we go. Maybe kind of change the pitch a little bit. Yeah, that's the one. 
So you have like a crazy intro. And then now, now that the thing is like kind of easing us into the beat, I like to add something that like adds like a little drop. Actually, I kind of like this because what I'm going to do, oh no, oh my, ooh, okay, and then extend that, uh, That's sick. It sounds like a zombie. There you go. You do. You kind of want it to match up, right? Ooh, that is sick. Because what you can do, let's just take a step off that, like. See what that sounds like. <laughs> so and then let's see. Now we can add like a little like uh, like a little crazy sound, maybe like I'm trying to think where it's at. Where is it at? Uh it's in sound effects. There we go. Ooh, that is that is cool. So you can skip here. Ooh, that is cool. Actually, really cool. So, so now we can play pattern. What do I want to start out with? Why is that not playing? Maybe it'll play on the thing. What the fuck? Did I mute it? Oh, that's that's heck and why. There we go. You want it to be like a little extended. Okay. Ooh, let it let it build up. Kind of give the audience a little bit of a blue ball. Actually, what we can do here is to make it sound a little better. Whoa. We can add a, like a little sound effect. Hmm, where's the stuff that I need? Uh, is it here? Ooh. Ooh, maybe like a phone will sound good. I kind of want it to be like, kind of quiet so we can do like a small sound let's see like that Ooh. Yeah, something like that Actually, I think we add it like he's gonna miss the phone call. So there we go. This should sound good. Whoa! And then maybe now 
Now we have a second drop to like really add. Ooh, I kind of like that. Because then boom, you go into it. Turn that volume up. Let's do a little. Okay. And then we go into the main beat. Something like this. And then let's just kind of add everything. So like that drop really hits like freaky. Add the snare, the acoustic, and the other acoustic. And then copy paste. Let's see how that sounds. Uh-oh, pick up the phone. Okay, that sounded a little wonky. So I say remove these snares. Mmm, actually. I think maybe we remove some of the, maybe like that. Oh, okay. See what I did, I removed one of those so that didn't like immediately, the melody was able to smooth in a little better. Maybe remove one of the snares. Maybe that'll sound cooler. And then you kind of want it to be like a full song, so you kind of just like just double what you made and just put it over. And then, uh, I can do this, copy paste, and then do some of this. But let's add a little transition. Uh, maybe just like a cell phone sound. Oh, uh-oh, messing it up. Uh -huh. So, add a cell phone sound. as like a mini transition. And then, I think, actually, we probably die this down. Uh... I think maybe just keep the rides. I think that'll probably sound good. And then probably one of these, and then just remove that one. That sounds pretty cool. Uh oh. Yes. Okay. So now Okay, that was pretty sick. So now I think what we do You kind of I'm just going to use this actually Is that PewDiePie? Dude, 
that's PewDiePie. I'm putting that on. That is crazy. I didn't know PewDiePie was here. Oh, okay. So now, I think this is the whole beat. I don't think there's really much more I can add. You got your, you got your introduction. You got, you got a, uh, like transitions in between to like kind of make it sure it's not like too crazy. And then you like a drop, you know, and then it, so I'm just gonna turn off my face cam and then I'm just gonna let it play. And then we'll see how it goes. Okay, BRB. Wait, what the frick? Why is my mic not muted? My goodness gracious that is freaking cool if you like this beat hit me with like a subscribe so like I can make like more like tutorials and stuff I really enjoyed doing this you know I just kind of just cooked up something in like my free time and I felt like I just wanted to like share my knowledge with everyone a little bit That's uh, that's about it, I think. Uh, like I said, if you enjoyed, maybe like subscribe and like put a comment down, like being like, "Hey, doing a good job." Right. See you guys.